so I actually just stuck a die in there you have to watch the last two videos especially the last one where I used the die uh, the lights so now I stuck a different die in there and you can see on my uh, gauges where I have stuff spilt and where I stuck in the difference in its luminosity okay massive difference now let's use this one no problem at all we're definitely working there and this is what happens when you uh, get the right light right dye and the right combination yep. got something going on there so as you see in the last video whatever dye they stuck in there none of the lights really could fluoresce very well and I'm in a shadow dark garage imagine trying to make a diagnosis out in the Sun in a bright parking lot not all the time all year long in a rush in an AC shop cars start getting diagnosed out in the parking lot because there's not enough room in the shop so if you don't have the right light and you don't have the right dye you could look all you want but if the ambient light is too high the technician will never find a leak all right let's see what we find after this getting ready to fill it up down to 1100 microns